Anyway, I deleted that guy's messages. It was just making me mad just watching them. <laughs> day I'm here just a little bit over my halfway point on my walk this morning really nice scenery not sure how it looks on that video it's a lot more like red and at least on the screen it looks orange but yeah walk going pretty good I'm really trying to focus on like increasing my pace uh, make sure I'm kind of walking fast. Um, the issue I have is with waking up. So I have my alarm set for 545, which is like 15 minutes before I want to leave. But the problem is I keep snoozing until 6 o'clock. So I end up leaving about 15 minutes late. Which means that I can only do about 45 minutes, which is fine for now, but I really want to start like increasing the duration um, to get up to that hour. And then once I'm kind of comfortable in getting that hour and consistently, I want to, you know, start adding some like jogging and stuff into it, not just walking. And that use that to get my steps up, but <sighs> I don't know, mornings. I right but I don't know it's going good so far you know I'm not like, super miserable being up this early so that's good but yeah anyway we're starting this day off right so let's go You guys doing up so early? Here oh, we usually wake up at this hour. Oh yeah. Here we are. Like usually we wake up early. Well, you should sleep in. It's great. What is it? I think I So I'm off to work. And I'm sure you guys are thinking, why is he wearing green? It's only Tuesday, right? Should be wearing red. And you're absolutely right. Today's a little different. Today is the day I become famous. Realization of 35 years in the making. All the dreams coming true. Now, um, my company is and has been over the last, I don't know how many years, one of the fastest growing companies in the country. And we live in a college town. Now it's a decent sized college town, but we're kind of picky on who we hire. And I think we're getting to the point where we're having a hard time getting enough people to, uh, enough qualified people to come in and and uh, work for us so uh, they've been doing these commercials and putting them in like the movie theater and stuff like that so you know just so people are aware of what's out there so um, I'm actually gonna be in one of the commercials or at least I'm gonna go film today to be in one of the commercials we'll see <laughs> if they if they see the footage and they're like Nope, not going to put him in there. We'll see. But, uh, yeah, anyway, so long story short, I'm wearing green because I couldn't find my red shirt. So I got my crock pot here. We're doing a barbecue for uh, our department. And so, we got to cook up some meat or something. It's going to be awesome. Super tasty and stuff. Yeah, I love barbecue. 
So yeah, yesterday, yesterday's vlog was a little different. I didn't have pretty much anybody else in it. There was a little clip of Ryan that Flame filmed. And uh, that's because I didn't get home until after the boys were in bed. So, wasn't much else to film. <laughs> Plus I talked so much in the car about um, the calorie counting and, and all that stuff. So, I figured it would be long enough. Or it wouldn't be an issue. But today should be a little bit more of a normal vlog, so yeah, we'll see. Yeah, so I'm I'm planning on making tomorrow, so Wednesdays are gonna be one of my rest days. And so Wednesdays and Sunday are gonna be my non-walking days. Just pull across the thing, go like two miles an hour. Cool. And, uh, Wednesdays has typically been my resting day due to basketball. I'm usually pretty sore after basketball, so, uh, it's nice to not have to worry about getting up and walking. But, you know, if it's not that bad, maybe I'll just keep doing it anyway and do it Monday through Friday and then not worry about it over the weekends or something. I don't know. We'll see. Eventually, I want to get to the point where 10,000 is the norm and uh, everything else exercise-wise is going to be making it a lot higher. So 10,000 is kind of the goal now, but it's I'm planning on making it quite a bit more in the future. A little ways down, not quite there yet. So, you know, whatever. It is what it is. So, film my commercial today. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be famous. It was super amazing. I did great. Probably gonna make cinema history just with the performance, and uh, should be pretty fantastic. So. Anyway, we, like I was saying, we record the, like we have some commercials and we play them um, in like the movie theaters and stuff around here. Uh, just trying to get people to come work uh, at our at our company because, you know, like we need, we're growing so fast and we need so many people. If the, com if I end up getting access to the commercial once it's all done, um, I'll try to include it in the vlog or something if I can, uh, we'll see but should be pretty awesome. Uh, we're just talking about different things that we really like about our job. And uh, the, one, the one I got was foosball and free soda. So those are my two lines right there, foosball and free soda. <laughs> we'll see. They didn't go like, oh, can you try that again? So I don't know, it was, it was probably really bad. Like I'm a horrible actor. Anytime that I try to act, like it's really bad. And so hopefully I just said the thing and hope, cause you know, like I do this every day now. So hopefully that some of that rubs off or something, I don't know. Hopefully it's not too dark. I'm about to head to basketball. And I wanted to talk about something. So, I released a couple of videos talking about the Gear Fit 2. I've got it. It has a lot to do with my vlog. And I, I think some people can value the opinion of someone who's actually owned it used it on a daily basis, constantly. You know, whatever, versus somebody who pulls out of the box, tries it for a couple days, and gives their opinion. 
And so today, someone decided to leave a comment on there about how if I wanted to be taken more seriously, I should not do a review while I'm driving and being unsafe. Now, I decided to respond to this idiot and I wish I didn't. I got sucked into it and I ended up deleting his comments or whatever. But basically he was saying that vlogging when you're driving is not safe, it's hazardous. And so I asked the question, well, is talking while you're driving unsafe then? Because that's what I'm doing. And then his follow-up was, you look at the camera, therefore you're unsafe. Now, I don't even have to go back and watch that video to know how much or little I look at the camera. I don't look at the camera that much. And if you go back to your driver's ed manual, which you probably don't remember, sir, is they never say, do not take your eyes off the road. They say you shouldn't have your eyes off the road for more than two seconds at a time. I guarantee I was not looking at the camera for more than two seconds. I probably wasn't looking at the camera for more than one second. Unless I'm stopped. Because I'm not a moron. <laughs> like, I don't know. It really irritated me because, like, safe driving is kind of something that I'm big into. I'm probably one of the most offensive drivers that I've, that I know. I don't speed, I don't tailgate, I stop completely at all stop signs and stop lights. If I'm doing something in the car other than driving, such as talking to a passenger, talking to my camera, talking to my stereo, adjusting my stereo, no matter what I do while I'm driving, it always takes a back seat to the driving. <laughs> Just as anything in life should happen. That's why I made that video making fun of people getting hurt playing Pokemon Go. If you're doing something <laughs> besides interacting with the physical world, you can't have that be your focus. And I know some people have a hard time focusing. I know some people, they get into a conversation and then, then they just like stop paying attention to their driving. Like people can be a lot more distracted doing stuff like that versus me on a camera. And you know, he made a judgment about me after probably watching what, like five seconds of my video, you know, told me he's not going to unsubscribe because I'm unsafe. Honestly, I don't care. You know, if that's really what you're concerned about, whatever you know why don't you go tell all the other vloggers out there hey there's videos out there of people playing Pokemon Go while driving while not even looking at the, the road for like 10 seconds at a time why don't you go comment on their videos I think that's what probably needs it more than me but anyway I even though I'm irritated about it and you probably can't even like see me anymore because it's getting dark um, you know, I'm, I'm kind of glad I got some negative feedback and that's literally the first time I've gotten any kind of negative feedback while doing YouTube and I've been doing YouTube, not these vlogs, but I've been doing YouTube for over two years now and that's like the first real negative comment I got and I kind of take that as a good sign you know, I'm doing something that someone doesn't agree with which is good for me because honestly I care way too much what other people think and I put too much effort into trying to make sure I'm doing stuff that people think I should be doing and so you know so what I'm driving I'm talking to you on my camera but guess what I'm paying attention to where I'm driving. You'll notice that usually when I'm driving, there's, you know, cuts and stuff. 
because there's long pauses where I'm driving and looking at the road and not talking because I'm focusing on something that's happening outside of my vehicle. Kind of crazy, you know. There's a thing called editing. But I'm here at basketball and this whole video was literally how every single video of mine goes. I start the camera while I'm not moving before I start the car. I get to my place and I'm done. Like, I'm not sure. Please, If you found something that I just did unsafe there, please point it out. I love feedback. But honestly, I was driving. I was talking to you, but I was driving while I was talking to you. Anyway, I deleted that guy's messages. It was just making me mad just watching them. <laughs> and then just, I was gonna keep like, having to respond just further and further. So, whatevs. So, done with basketball. Ended up with over 1,800 steps for the day, which is really cool. Um, kind of ended on a frustrating note. Just some punk playing basketball almost got in a fight with me. It's just frustrating. So, I'm just really worked up about it right now. So, anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.